Welcome back, guys, and welcome to the town of Esterford. Yes, well, the village, I should say, the village of Esterford. Now, the, the region as a whole uh, is, uh, is New Skyland, but this is the village of Esterford, and it's been named after its founder. Uh, you know what? I'm probably going to witter on for a bit, so let me let me just uh, yeah, I'm going to pause it, just slow it down. You know what? We'll just we'll just slow it down to like two times because I, I want them to like kind of get on with stuff. Um, right, look, poor old Kel, Kel the cleric, died, died of old age, died of a broken heart, I think, because he didn't get you know the church and stuff. Um, we need, you know what? We need the the priest needs a house the priest definitely needs a house and I'm thinking see like normally right you'd think okay house right let's take a house and we'll, we'll plonk it down next to the church but I'm thinking that maybe we put the house like over here so that he comes like out of his house and comes in through in the back way who were uh, misses he goes in the back way. Um, kids, if you didn't understand that, ask your parents. Um, they'll be happy to explain. <laughs> oh God, I'm, go I'm going to hell for that one. Um, yeah, right. So, um, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm thinking at the moment. Now, um, uh, so, uh, town meeting. Town meeting. The um, the priest, uh, whatever her name was. What was her name? Um, Gainer? Gainer, was it? Can't remember. Uh... Gala, Gala, Gala would have called a, a town meeting, and uh, and told people, um, right, come on, you know, I can't keep walking from the town all the way to the church. Actually, let's check out the um, the pathing. Path thinking about it, where's she having to come from? Yeah, I don't want like having to walk like up here, like especially at night, like if I'm out go, you know, visiting sick people and you know, or you know, the things that they do, the priest, you know, having to go back, I, I, you know. I want my house over here, and then people can come and visit me, and I can be important. So, um, yeah, so the, the, the first meeting, the first issue at the meeting is that. The second mission, mission is, the second issue is um, the guy saying, look, I've had enough now. Either we get some alcohol, or I move it out. So, that's what we're going to do next. We're going to set up some alcohol. We're going to turn some of this honey. We've got tons of food, so we're going to turn this honey into mead. Now, I'll tell you now, I have no idea how the hell to do that. I'm guessing that there's some kind of inn or something. Oh, hang on, the Abbey. Oh, the Abbey's cool. Back alley. Um, yeah, it's going to be, is it going to be, it's going to be in here, isn't it? I would think. We've got the candlery. Oh, the silkworm. Oh, God, there's so much cool stuff in here. Sure house. Is it under food? I don't, I'm thinking it might be sugar house. Dairy. That's the bees. Oil press. Gather us up. No, you know what? It, no, it's not. Where the hell? Where the hell? Are they the inns and stuff? Walls and buildings. Alcohol. See, it's a completely new tab. Alcohol production. Inn and garden. Oh, very cool. Brewery. Brews alcohol. Winery, distillery. Oh, 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 oh. oh my God! Everybody's going to be absolutely smashed. So I'm thinking. Um, I'm thinking. Well, I guess brewery. And I guess we want to put it like over here. Actually, that's a, kind of a good place for it. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe there. Uh, See, so if I put it there, I don't think there's enough room to put some houses in next to it, which I kind of would like. Um, but that kind of, yeah, no, I like it there. I like it, screw it. I, I'm going for the aesthetics, I don't care. So we're, we're putting the brewery in. And we'll see, like, we'll see what it does. I, I, I kind of, I kind of just winging it at the moment. Right, let's, um, let's do a bit of, a bit of roading then. So we want a road, kind of, like, round. Ooh, ooh, I put an extra bit in. Right, so we'll put a road round there. And we'll double it up and we'll extend it in front of that house. There we go. Cool. That works. I like that. 
So we'll get this brewery done. We'll see. Uh, we'll see what that does. So we'll get that going. Right. Good, excellent. Right. So oh, how's the crazy woman in the in the woods doing? God, I uh, I have such a bonehead. I should have got the bison going, but you know, it is what it is. And like, don't like like leave me millions. I'm sure you'll have already left me millions of comments saying, ah, oh, your, your bison starved to death in the yard and all the rest of it. It doesn't matter. The guys, chill. Seriously, it doesn't matter. There'll be lots more animals. We're doing. We're absolutely flying. We're absolutely flying. Look, tools. Two hundred now. Boom. Right. We've got. We've, we've got warm clothes. We've got tons of food. We've got tons of everything. Logs is at the max. We've got um, firewood's going to be up to the max. We've got loads. Yeah, we've got loads of everything. Let's see how the crazy woman's doing. The crazy woman that lives in the house. Here we go, Dollarine. She's not an old woman though. She's a crazy young woman, with a with a one year old child. Uh, so, can you pronounce that? Sit sit lally. <laughs> She's definitely crazy. Right, how are we doing production wise? Let's have a look. This is going to be interesting. Thirty three herbs last season. How many? How many is she going to produce this season? And what effect is it going to have on our health? That's going to be interesting to um, to watch over the next the next few months as time goes on. We're in a late spring. It'll be a very pleasant time. Look at all the people coming down the road. Now, are the people using the road? Oh, yes, they are. They are actually using the path to the crazy woman in the woods. <laughs> Love it. Oh, well, yeah, she is the herbalist, so that's cool. I've got a herbalist and a labourer in there. I'm just like, I'm, I'm really tempted to speed this up and see, um, see how she's how she's doing with the uh, with the herb gathering. But it's cool. Loads of people coming down here, so I'm guessing loads of people need the old herbs to get um, to get healthy. But we're at um, we're at a solid three now, so I think that's actually maybe started to tick up a little bit. We'll see. Uh, the average happiness has come down a little bit, so it's good that we're getting the alcohol going now because that'll definitely please them. Um, I'm thinking the happiness is coming down a little bit because we don't have any more room in the graveyard. The graveyard is full, but doesn't this look good now? Like with the you know. With all the gravestones going on and right, oh man. Right. Let's do let's do a house. Let's do a house. Right. Now what type of house are we gonna go for? Oh, trader. Now nah, I see I'm gonna start paying attention to traders now because I want um, the seeds and all that kind of stuff. What have we got? Yeah, this is just Oh, the bakery supplier. Ooh, now we could buy some corn and do some stuff and sorghum as well. That's, I know that, I'm not sure exactly what that's used for, but I know that's used in the, uh, in the production chains. What have we got? Like, corn, flour. Ooh, oh, oh, oh. Do we, like, just get this guy to bring us to corn until we can get seeds and stuff? We've got wheat as well. Oh, man. It's very tempting, you know. Very tempting. Especially since we've got so much food, it's not like it's necessarily going to get eaten. Um, nah, you no, know, no, you know what? No, we've got, we've, we've got a million other things to do. You know, we'll wait for seeds. So, thanks for coming. Really appreciate it. You can go away now. Thanks. Oh, man. So, Esterford, the village of Esterford. We need some steel tools. I, You know, I, I think I really should get a bit of mining going on and I'm thinking maybe round here we could put in a bit of a coal mine or something get some coal being produced then I make some steel tools then we can get this going that would be pretty sweet oh look at this look, look. the brewery's coming along oh so you've got the barrels outside oh they're gonna be so excited oh I can't wait to get my beer I'm looking forward to that <laughs> right what the hell was I gonna put in oh a mine yeah and the, I, I love, I absolutely love what they've done with mines. Because uh, mines used to kind of annoy me. Because like once they run out, you're just left with this mine there. But now, once a mine runs out, you can upgrade it to a deep mine. 
and when that runs out you can upgrade it to a deeper mine and you need to supply them with candles and stuff because then they're working underground and stuff but like, I just love that whole thing that they've done with it's um, it's nothing short of staggeringly awesome. I need to get a shore house going as well for sand, so we can do glass and stuff. Right, where the oh man, like where the hell are the the mining stuff? Where, has this been moved into another tab or something? So, uh, no. Oh, mine! Oh, mine! There we go. I'd forgotten what icon it was. Right, let's um, let's spin you round. Oh, that way. Oh, oh yeah, it's not going to go in there. What about that? Oh, 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 yep, yep, we can get it in here somewhere. Like, oh, come on, come on, be good, be good. So, like there, I think is the best place for it. Yep, that's going to happen. So, boom. We put in our mine. Excellent stuff. Right, now we need... Um, they need a stockpile. So let's put in a stockpile for them. And um, we want a... We want a decent-ish kind of stockpile. Probably for these guys. Uh, can we get a decent-ish stockpile in here? Oh, that's, the, that's the only issue. So I'm trying to find the corner of the building. So it's... It's there. That's the corner. So we'd want a stockpile. Oh man, we can't we can't get a decent stockpile in. We could put a little one in there. That's not a whole hell of a lot of use though, is it? Um You know what? Let's put let's put a little two by four in there. Did that go in? Yeah it did. Uh, so that's the corner. Can we put like another little something? Oh, I could put a 1x2 in. There we go. So that's... We've got a, we've got a little bit of stockpile going on on that side. Let's let get... Let, I, I think I'm going to let that get built and see what it looks like. And then... like Once I can actually see what the hell I'm doing... I'll put probably another stockpile in and we'll put some houses in for the miners. Oh, and that thing's going to start producing coal, I think. Right, this is up and running now. So let's get um, let's get a brewer in there. Right, what are you going to make? Mead from honey. There you go. <laughs> oh, I'm loving it. I'm absolutely loving it, sir. I really am. You're all very nice people in this town. As long as I get my mead, I'm happy man. And you know what? I'm just gonna like just fill in this road, just kind of a little bit. So we'll just have it kind of overlapping by one. Looks, I think it looks a little bit better. There we go. Yeah, that's that's way better. That's way better. So Esterford, here's the lovely town of Esterford. Uh, now, I w one thing that I want to see, I want to see, does this like, oh, okay. So we can't have a single road coming up here. We definitely need a double. So, re like, regardless of anything else, I'm going to have a double stone road coming out here. That's the first thing. And I think it's fair to say that there should definitely be a double in front of the church as well. Boom. Right. There we go. I'm going to be doing this like little step by step and stuff. Right. Let's um let's get the old house going for this guy. So um a stone house would be kind of cool. A country house would be kind of nice as well. But we need glass for that. So you know what? I think for now a stone house. If that's what I'm thinking. And I think this is going to get improved over time. So I think what we want... How do, how do I want to kind of lay this out? Um, okay. Because well, I'm, I'm, I'm just sort of planning this out in my mind at the moment. How this is going to be. Okay, got an idea. Okay, got an idea. Right, so... 
we put the house in. Cool, excellent. Then we're going to have um, what kind of path are we going to have into the house? I think it's probably going to be. I think it's probably going to be a stone. Just to show, just to show the affluence. You know, I, I, you know, I'm, I'm going to move that. I'm going to move it one further over. I think. Um, yeah, I'm going to move it one further over. Let's do that again. This is, uh, it's going to be all like this for now. Rutherabert died. Oh man, poor Rutherabert. He, yeah, he must have been getting on though, Rutherabert. He was the the youngest. Was Rutherabert the youngest of the um, of the family? Younger brother of um, Lilam and Lara. I'm not sure if Rutherabert was the youngest. I, th I think he might have been. Um, right, let's get back to this um, this stone house. So I. Uh, I want to leave another. Yeah, that's what I want. Right, and you'll see why in a second. Right, so what we're going to have is we're going to have um, a path to the to the back garden. It's going to have a nice little garden around the back. So let's uh, let's have a road and a stone road. So I want a path going round the back of the house. To the front as well. There we go. So it's surrounded by a little stone path, and then in the the back, he's going to have a little back garden here. So what we want, we want um, what do we want? We want decorative items, and we want hedges. Where's the hedges? There's the hedges, and I want uh, customized hedges. And we're going to go for the half height hedges on this side. Because he wants to show off his garden. Uh, so what we're going to have, I think, we want, um, we want a half hedge tip. Let's spin that uh, around that way. So we want a half hedge tip. Um, yeah, because he's uh, oh, mind you, because they've got gates and also, uh, you know, you know what? No, we'll just do it like this. I think we'll get we'll get we'll get fussy later on. We've got a, a three-way intersection and then the corner, right? Okay, so we want that that. That. That's the corner there, isn't it? Yeah, so there. Then we'll throw in a corner. Um, which is. Oops. Come on, spin round. Oh, get you. Thank you. Get your tree out of my face. Right, let's uh, then take this across. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I didn't allow for the actual garden itself. Da! Da! Getting carried away. What do I want? Remove structures. Get rid of these two. Oh, yeah, you could do that. I'd seriously do this for hours and hours. Where are we? Decorative. Hedges. Customizable hedges. Right, half height. So, yeah, we want to go... Uh, spin that around. We want to go down here to there, don't we? Yeah, so... Then I want to put in... Yeah, yeah, let's do this. So, there, 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 there there that's and oh, one more and then it'll be the corner and the hedge coming down here cool excellent 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 where's the corners there's the corner so I want to spin it around that way that corner there and then we spin it around uh, no 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 which way? that way that way and then this corner is going to go in there Cool. And we go back to the straight. And that's going to come down here. Boom, boom, boom. And then we want to tip on this end. Half edge tip. Spin it round. Boom. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Right. Cool. Excellent. Now, um, obviously, there's going to be a statue of Estherford, the founder of the village, which is going to be in the middle of the town square. And a lot of these roads and stuff, as, as they become like proper roads, I mean, these aren't proper roads kind of at the moment, but once things become proper roads, I'm going to start naming them. And they're going to be named after like, um, 
people, you know, notable people from the village. So I'm sure, I'm sure Rutherford will probably have a a, a a street named after him or something. And there's like Talvar and Lilliman Lara, and they'll all have streets and stuff. Maybe even Mammy. Maybe, maybe even Mammy. Who knows? Who knows? This is looking really nice. I'm, I'm going to enjoy playing around with these and putting in little gardens for people and stuff. Um, oh, you know, oh, I am so tempted to put some flowers in his back garden. Oh. Oh, what are oh, flowers all around the back garden? Oh, I'm thinking it might be nice. Oh, I, no, I, sorry, I can't. I just can't resist it. And and you can put like different colours in, but I, I think I'm just going to put this basic one in and have a look at that and see how that is. And then we'll probably play around later. Loving it, absolutely loving it. Cool, right? Um, man, well, you know what? I'm, we're overrunning. <laughs> Doesn't the time fly when you play this game? Come out in the next episode, guys. I've no idea what we're going to be doing, but we'll be doing something. I'll see you for that one. <laughs>